thank you very much for a great opportunity to have uh, me to hear so to explain. So architectural behaviorology is a discipline that analyzing the proposing, oh sorry, um, uh, analyzing the propo uh, uh, proposing the architectural design for the good balance of the life on the earth in 21st century from the time access to the industrial change. We try to observe the architectural form as intersection of the three behaviors, uh, which is a climate and material, and the people and the living creature, like a plant, and also the building typology. And then uh, this is due to the fact of the over uh, the centuries, the value of the things has uh, shifted from the place, uh, placeability to the inter extendabilities of the time and space. Uh, information and globalization since uh, 20th century uh, have uh, cleared the place main uh, burden on our real earth. And uh, these changes have also the changed the concept of the ownership democratically and uh, sorry, uh, dramatically, so with, with uh, more the uh, private ownership and the uh, loss of the sharing the relationship with the natures. And um, uh, which used to be maintained and managed in a way that made sustainability visible through the sharing has also the broken down the creating the barrier to what used to be open other resources. In order to rethink this issue, we are working to the understanding the actor network in the questions, to understand the, uh, their balance, to remove the barrier that have somehow so been created, and uh, to uh, restore the creativity with uh, cultural resources that are open and visible. And in this context, the urban-rural commons studies in based on the research methodology of the Japanese ethnographer Wajiro Kon, who wrote the Japanese uh, fork house Minka in 1922. The Kon studied the relationship between the household of the farmers at the time, the land use and agriculture business, and the form their Minka, and the attempt to the capture change of the modernization. Now, more than 100 years later, we are trying to the grasp the situation of the primary industry in the terms of the household and communities and architecture forms to understand the problem and to the propose a, a method of the architectural design that the rural commons, which has become the unbalanced in the relation to the city, be regenerated uh, as a commons, including the, its relationship with the city. We have been working on this project in the area of the Japan and Switzerland as a case study and design proposal by hand drawings. Today I will show three cases of Atre Balwa as a part of studies. This first case study, Momonora village, is a project to revitalization of fishing village that was damaged by the 2011 Great East Japan earthquake and tsunami. So based on the interview and workshops uh, with the community, a future reconstruction plan was uh, uh, drawn up. And um, Oshika uh, Penny, uh, Fisherman's uh, f uh, school, the program was born out of the uh, concern over the lack of the uh, newcomer, the fisherman. The first session was held a year and a half after the disaster. The textbook was developed from the uh, field hearing uh, survey on the fishermen and the fisheries. And the 15 students participated. Uh, the fishermen served as a teachers, uh, teachers uh, giving the lecture and the fishing method and the fishing uh, processing and the local history. By time the uh, corona event, uh, the program has been held 12 uh, times 
and the two participants had uh, moved to the area, uh, apprentice uh, themselves to the fishermen and become the independent fishermen nowadays and the residents on the area. In that process, the creation of the place for the community exchange was raised as a new issue. The uh, possibility of this as a workshop program for the fishermen school was discussed uh, uh, by uh, uh, using the geographical resource model. And then this idea was put in a drawing the stage and the investor was sought and then uh, planted in the 1960s on the side that was uh, one field, once a field, the forest was thinning out and the construction material were prepared. At first, the main building designed by Atribawa was uh, constructed 2017. And then um, um, the accommodation to cottages uh, designed by the two young architects group were built in a summer school in which uh, local carpenter and the young architect uh, served as an instructor. And with uh, a process of the wood cut and site constructed to the uh, local sawmill, and since then, um, the Momonora village has been used as a base for the art event and uh, as a daily lodging uh, uh, facilities. A place for uh, urban-rural exchange was created by the taking advantage of the shape of the site, which used to be farm. And then, so next project is also the second uh, Koisuru Buta Laboratory, and the first uh, 1K was uh, commissioned by a welfare uh, cooperating uh, to the design and employment facility for the disabled in a rural village in Chiba, where the uh, population is aging and the depopulation. The facility is designed to support to the independence of the empowerment for people with a, dis a disability in the urban area too. And in 2012, the Koisuru Buta Laboratory was uh, uh, completed with the branding of the pork. Buta is pork in Japanese. And uh, a branding of the pork from the uh, pig farm business run by the uh, former president of the corporation. Uh, it's processed in plant uh, uh, and also the uh, restaurant where the visitor can taste the sausage and the shabu shabu hot pot, the hamburgers. And then employees at the uh, countryside is very limited. So regarding of the rather uh, whether one has a disability or not, the theme of this facility is to create an employment opportunity. Uh, by increasing the number of the opportunity, such as uh, cleaning and serving customers and the people with disabilities uh, can be motivated to work. The number of the employers uh, increasing and the uh, restaurant becomes a very popular place to eat local food. Wanke uh, leased uh, the land from the local forest industry and farmers who had abandoned their land due to the aging and used it as a base for the forest maintenance and uh, a production of the sweet potatoes and the local specialties. And um, so the, we, uh, we support this social welfare corporation so to make the forest maintenance job manual for disabled people. And at first we draw the all out the all work process about around it. And after the, we worked with the local forestry, the sawmill uh, factory and the carpenter with the traditional skill. And then the building was completed 2018 and then when we go there now, so the building is surrounded by the firewood stores, storage area from the forest the maintained and uh, everyone is very happily so, uh, going about uh, their work. So last project is a small earth project in Kamanuma in Chiba. Uh, this is the depopulating, depopulating so farming village of the 56 household, but half is so like another almost half in a Chiba prefecture. Uh, where terraced rice, the padding are made with the water uh, from the mountain. And then Muji, so one Japanese com uh, a commodity, so company, so a commodity company that supported this call from Yoshiki Hayashi, 
uh, a residents, the farm, so a farmer, so who moved to the area as a newcomer in 1999. And Atori Ebawa was asked to design a remote uh, workstation for Muji and the terraced rice field office in built in the 2016. And then community health event to the learn about the local uh, lifestyles, so including the terrace rice padding and the New Year decoration making, miso, soya sauce making, and more. And then uh, 2020, uh, 2018, so a large typhoon damaged the roof of Hayashi's main house, unfortunately, which was used as an exchange uh, cultural center. But it was uh, discovered that there was a third roof under the metal seat, and a third uh, restoration project was in initiated. And after asking the elderly, so a place for original search was founded, uh, make it. So, and then search was a recovery uh, slowly, uh, time by time, by people. And also the fund was right through the growing uh, crowd fund, and also half of the third was now the re replaced. And uh, with the process uh, document in the drawing by a student, that is also done very beautifully. So Yoshihar, uh, my partner at the laboratory, and also the uh, later, so uh, they found also the one very big largest uh, the farmhouse in the village was empty and uh, was also put up the for sales. And then, so they decided to, which was purchased by 20 investors uh, as a, a, a community uh, placement. And then Satoyama School of Design were beginning. Satoyama means mountain, uh, village mountain. And then so with everybody so working together to revitalize the area. And a lot of the project was uh, created as a shared small job by urban rural community. And a community kitchen was built by the uh, salvage material from the local uh, how locals or abandoned houses. And it is used as a cafe for um, the people, uh, as a, a meeting place. And then not only the Tsukamoto Laboratory of the Tokyo Institute of Technology, but many other laboratories have now joined the project and heard work at the building at a small shed for a short stay so in this area, because there is no good space for living a long time. So. So the these process becomes a learning platform for all, and a new craft, uh, they can learn as an old and new craft technique for building. So conclusions, how we can contribute our rural commons to be shared the process as a designer. So um, from learning these cases, I have list, listed so the 10 items are below, so I'm not here, so, but uh, is it one important thing uh, um, for architects to be a party uh, of the project? And then that means also the insider and outsider. So we need to have a two position around the project and also the two embodiment of the ecology is also very uh, important for me to uh, continue the work. So that is all, thank you very much.